the Stanley Cup, and it kicks off tonight. Both teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Takes it to the net. Denies him. This is him. the great goaltender who understands where the threats are. And this is the The Blues gain possession along the wall. Quick pass to Thomas. Now a quick pass to Bushnevich. And that doesn't reach the net. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Here's a short pass to Shen. Denies him again. I'm not sure where the defense is, but I'll tell you what, the goaltender has been outstanding. Made a flurry of saves to keep his team in this one. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still scoreless in this one. Minnesota's got it in the defensive zone. Looks to get the puck over to Boldy. And that's poked away by Pareko. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. And that's a great read to force the turnover. Picked up here in the neutral zone by Rossi. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Oh, there's one more. Just fantastic work by the goaltender, making consecutive saves. How athletic. St. Louis has won the faceoff here in their own end. Kapanen's carrying it ahead. Takes possession. Big hit, and that frees up possession. St. Louis has it behind the net. Slides it across to Hartman. They gain the zone from the left side. Handles the puck at the point. Scores! And with that, I believe that's his first career playoff goal. Well, it is, James, and it's going to feel pretty good because there's a lot of question marks around players who can't get it done in the playoffs, and he finds the back of the net. That's going to give him a big confidence boost to send him through the next game. We all know that goals in the playoff series are so difficult to come by, James, as the ice closes up and everyone's playing urgent and physical. They got the first one here. That's a good way to start. Minnesota's efforts pay off as they get the game's first goal three inch closer to the midway mark of the first. Yeah, and they're inching closer and closer to more goals here as they get the first one of the game. And sometimes scoring is a struggle, James, but when you put one by the tender, often it comes in bunches. Picked up along the boards by Felino. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Coughs it up on the play. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Here's a centering pass. And that's stopped. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We got a 1-0 game to this point. Letieri's won the draw here in their own zone. And he takes the dish. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that's stolen by Letieri. Beatington's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. The Blues have been the busier team offensively with scoring chances, but they still trail in the first. St. Louis has the puck here off the faceoff. The Blues work it through center. Minnesota's got the puck along the wall. Oh, and a great hits up play to force the turnover by Blay. In front of the net, and the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Centers glide into the dot as a faceoff ready to resume play. Erickson X, quick stick off the draw, wins possession. And he takes the feed. The Blues take it along the wall. Minnesota's got the puck in their own end. St. Louis has it in the offensive end. And he denied that opportunity. The Blues gain control of the puck. Korpchenko's got it in the corner. Quick shot! And he wins the post! Stones him in front. My goodness, they are
love the way he's dangling in tight spaces here, James. He knows how to create space for himself and just enough to get to the goaltender and finish it off. Well past the midway mark of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And now it's grabbed by Middleton. Here's a chance! Denies him! He got all of it! Oh, and another quick stop! That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Moves it quickly over to Shen. Forces the turnover in the defensive zone. Good hit to knock the puck loose. St. Louis has possession of the puck. Handles the pass. Shot in front! Here's a shot. Glove save. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. St. Louis takes possession off the draw. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. From the slot, wrist shot. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Minnesota's won the draw. Here's a shot, and that goes off a of body. Taken along the wall by Hayes. Look at this, they've got some bodies here on the attack. And he turned that aside as we continue play here. And they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And he gets just enough to keep it out. Here's a shot. And that turns off a body in traffic. Quick shot. Moves it to Bogosian. Nice zone entry from the middle. Moves it to the middle. Another pass. Oh, and he keeps it here. And now he tries to get it across to Sunfist. And that's poked away. Minnesota's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. The Blues have it against the wall. Launches them into the boards. Here's a shot, and he shuts the door on that. Saad's lugging the puck. Fires it. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Here in the late goings of the period, we got a tie game. And with the two setters tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Into the offensive zone. Into the corner now. The Blues gain possession. And he slides it quickly to Bushnevich. St. Louis takes it across the line. Brodeen's moving the puck through his own zone. Rocks him on the play. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. Oh, I know what he was trying to do there, James. He thought he had it with that move, but he created some space for himself, but unfortunately loses the handle and it dies on his stick. Brodeen's got it against the boards. Quick feed to Goudreau. the horn still 40 more minutes left in regulation time we'll get to the second period right after this and the official seems about ready to drop the puck on period number two well let's see who comes out hungrier here in this second as we are still tied 
Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment? Minnesota's performance in the first period was lackluster. They didn't generate any offense, and they weren't attacking with any kind of speed. They're going to have to find a way to shore that up, James, because their opponent is really taking it to them. They're fortunate that this game is still tied. Brodeen's into the offensive zone now on the attack. St. Louis has it near the wall. Pareko's got it in the defensive end. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Scooped up along the wall by Shen. Here's a shot! They score! And the deadlock is broken as they take the lead! Well, that's a huge shift. You can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. I mean, there's so much traffic, net front. I mean, screens all over the place. You can see him trying to track Bob and Weave, but he can't catch up to it. St. Louis leads it by one here in the second. Uh, it's been a competitive back and forth game, and sometimes in these games, you gotta grind it out. That's exactly what they did, and they find themselves with the lead. Great reach with the poke check. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Quick pass to Kairou. Oh, what a smart heads up play. His reflexes on display tonight. And that's knocked away by Kaepernick. Gaining momentum along the boards. Broken up by Falk. Slick feed. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Moves it to the middle. And that's intercepted. Moves the puck. Takes the pass. Club save. Peterson's going to hang on for the whistle here. It's been a whole hum night for him. Well, it really has. He has to been tested, but it is a close game, and he's got to come up big. He has to stay dialed in and focused in this one. The Blues have put a lot of pucks on net, and they continue to lead here early in the second. Minnesota's got it, and they're on the attack. Cuts into the paint. St. Louis tries to break out from their own end. Takes the feed. The Blues looking against the half wall. Middleton's taking it from his own end. And he's knocked off the puck there. Fires it on net. Caught into the glove by Gustafson. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. We've got a 2-1 game. The Blues win the draw. Puck picked up by Sunfist. And they keep the pressure on. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. Pinned up along the boards. The Blues gain control of the puck against the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Textbook poke check by Neighbors. Here they are on the attack. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Bennington. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. The Blues continue to lead it here in the second period. They have been very active in the offensive zone tonight. Picks up the puck in his own end. The Blues are in transition. Takes a shot. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Gustafson. I love that he swallowed this one up with his glove. It's a real threat coming from the slot area. No rebound to boot. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. Lettieri's won a big draw on their own end. Here's a short pass to Shen. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. Minnesota's got possession of the puck. Trying to shake loose. He's in all alone. I think he got confused what he was gonna do there. You can see him looking at the goaltender, whether he's gonna shoot or deke, and while he's thinking, he's running out of real estate. Throws it in. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck now. And now he angles it across, all alone! This is a great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Brodeen stick handling in his own zone. From along the boards, moves the puck ahead. Fires it on net. Oh, he didn't get all of it, but just enough to keep it out of the net. 
Sends it quickly to Thomas. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. And they'll dump it in. Takes the feed up ahead. Moves it quickly over to Hartman. Biddington's gonna hang on for a whistle. Past the midway mark of the frame, it's a 2-1 hockey game. Gautreaux's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. St. Louis gains a hold of it. Moves it to play. The Blues played along the wing. Oh, just a great heads-up play by Johansson. Minnesota's been working hard away from the puck, and they're using their awareness to take away angles and seams. And this is something they're doing with their stick positioning. Coach talked about it pre-game, how important it was going to be. The Blues continue to lead in the second. They have been the busier team in the shot department, and as a result, they lead. Minnesota's gonna start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Scores! Off the post and in! Well, that's a real sneaky one that fooled the goaltender, James. I had not much room available, but that one, perfectly executed. Man, that looked like a goal scorer's goal. Just a knack for the net, but it all comes off of a beautiful distribution. I mean, just eyes in the back of the head to be able to give that gift right to the stick. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Erickson X won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Drills them. Grabbed along the board by Erickson X. Quick feed to Zuccarello. Great fortune by Erickson X. St. Louis has it against the half wall. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Late goings of this period. We are all tied up in this one. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Oh, a clutch save! Puck scooped up by Erickson Eck. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Oh, save of the play! Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. Too much congestion in front. Picked up along the wall by Scandella. Sends it over to Kapanen. Cutting to the slot. Oh, tremendous save of the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that. James and the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Oh, what a save in front. This shot's come from the middle of the ice and it has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position and he makes the save. Picked up along the boards by Scantella. Uses the force on that hit. The Wild have the puck against the boards. And it's a quick pass to Bogosian. Nice try to get in alone. Makes the save. See this one on one battle, and the goaltender is so dialed in. Trying to get a step all alone. Sends it over. With the pass. Well, two periods down, and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. for period number three is ready to go. The next goal will be a critical one as we are still tied, getting underway here in the third. Can't make the play and the puck leaves the zone. Puck grabbed by Krug. And now he moves it quickly to Shen. And he gives it over to Thomas. St. Louis has it in the defensive end. Gaining steam here on the attack. Minnesota's got control of it now from their own end. 
And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. He is so dangerous when the puck is on his stick in the offensive zone, but he tries one too many. in the third and we are tied. Well, nothing better than getting the equalizer to set the sails in the right direction and you can feel the urgency in their game right now and you know that they've made the adjustments that they talked about with the staff and man that they come out really strong in this third. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. St. Louis wins the draw. They put the puck into the offensive end. Here's a short pass to Scandella. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. The center field! He scores! What a goal! Well, he's in tight to the net, James, and he knows that he's not going to have much time or space to get it off, so he elects to the Blues coaching staff must be pleased with this start, jumping out to a one-goal lead here in the third. Yeah, you know, it's all about being urgent and not changing the mindset that got you the lead, right, James? You want to make sure that you're attacking at all costs because you know that you've held the puck, so you can. Yes. Stop! Sunday strike once again. What they do? Two goals. A 
lock is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And it's kicked away. Scooped up along the wall by Erickson Eck. Minnesota's crossed the line and on the attack. Kaprizov's got the puck. Tries to feed it over to Bogosian. And will play on as that gets a piece of the glove. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. More than half the frame has been played here. The Blues holding down a 5-3 lead in what has been a fun one for hockey fans to watch tonight. Taken by Krug. Slides the puck to Torpchenko. Hooked away by Merrill. Steps inside the line. Minnesota's got the puck against the wall. And he had the answer on that play. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Oh, what a stop! Gustafson's gonna hang on to the puck and get a stoppage in play. Nothing gives confidence to a team more than a big save, and he's been doing it all night, James. St. Louis coaches insisted lots of shots on net going into this one, and they have done that and continue to lead in the third. Minnesota's got the puck in their own end. Tries to get it over to Boldy. Great defensive effort with the stick. Moves it to Rossi. Routine pass saved made by Bennington. Well, the game certainly isn't predictable, is it, James? As it's going back and forth, goals from all areas as players shoot from all angles and attack the zone. Shot! Scores! Well, don't turn this off just yet. We've got ourselves a game. Well, definitely the only one now. Their opponent is on their heels, and now they're playing with a sense of urgency. Watch out. You can feel the wave coming, James. I love this snapshot from in tight, James, that beats the goaltender, but how about the will to get to those tough areas? I mean, that's what it's all about. You can have the skill, but you gotta have the will. Minnesota's got one back here in the third, but they still need another. They're gonna have to swarm the puck and find a way to retrieve it. And it's shot selection as well. Good opportunities, get to the slot and find a way to convert. A chance up front! Another pass! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there! 14 minutes, 6 seconds. Past the midway mark in this period. Minnesota's trailing by one. Off the draw, they take possession. And he slides it quickly to Maroon. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Keeps a hold of it on the play. Moves the puck across to Shen. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Now a quick pass to Duhane. He carries the puck up along the wing. Here's a shot. Gives them nothing in front. I really like to save James because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Carla Bay is standing by with who had the better night. Thomas wanted to have a strong game, and he came out here and delivered. I think he's been the standout player in this one, guys. Oh, what a little stick lift on the play and comes up with the puck. And now it's grabbed by Zuccarello. Stops him cold. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. What a steal in his own end. Oh, making his presence felt with a hit. Oh, there's a great save by Gustafson. This is just great puck control to put the puck to the corner. No second shot opportunity. Quick feed to Zuccarello. Here they come on the attack. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. Slides it to Letty. Looks to make a play over to Hayes. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. The Blues gain control of the puck. Beautiful saucer pass. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. With the stop. And he slides it quickly to Zuccarello. Oh, they do it again. Zuccarello has really impressed me with that last play, James. I mean, you got the wherewithal to hold on to that puck. I mean, that's tenacity on your way down, falling to the ice and still get the shot off. That's leadership at its best. Denies him on the one-timer. Oh, what reaction. Attacker out here for the face-off. Well, they'll be looking for a quick win. 
in and advance that puck right to the net. Minnesota's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. And puts the body into it. A little bumper car hockey. Comes up with the stop. I'm not sure how he saw this puck, James. I mean, he screened. There's a ton of traffic, and he finds the puck to make the save. That one's a fabulous one. Here we go. Face off inside the offensive end. The net is empty. They've got the extra attacker out. Minnesota's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Scores! They tied it up. They tied it up with seconds to spare. Well, they really have been a flurry at the end of this third period, haven't they, James? I mean, they've been tenacious and they've been competitive. It's a reason why they got the equalizer in the dying seconds of the frame. The extra attacker comes on with the goalie out of the net. They have the advantage and they use it perfectly. They're all over the ice. They're all over the puck. Coverage is running and they bury it. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. Controls, quick stick, lands from the puck here at center. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. Well, there you go. Three periods in the books, and we still don't have a winner. So keep those buckets tight, because we're going to sudden death overtime in moments. OT should tell us who wins and who loses, and they're ready to get it underway. And they drop the puck on overtime. Who wants it? Who's going to get it? A little bumping around, but still man chance possession. Minnesota's got the puck. A critical draw here. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Sends the pass over. Minnesota's gained possession along the boards. Oh, and that clanks off the iron. I like the habits and the shot selection right there, James, but lucky bounce to the top tender as he goes off the inside of the iron and stays out. Bennington's really impressed me tonight, James. Just look at that last sequence and that desperation save. Unbelievable. I mean, when it's required to be calm and poised, he's got quiet feet. But when he needs to move and make a desperation play, he does it. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Sometimes when you lose the puck, it's a product of trying to do too much. Sometimes he gave it a stick and he keeps it alive. Minnesota's taking possession in their own end. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. The Blues move it ahead. Pokes it away in his own end. And he feeds it down to Hartman. Moves it around along the half wall. Puck picked up by Rossi. Looking to end it. St. Louis gains the zone. Shot! Stopped with ease. From the left side, he moves it up. I'm not trying to take your job, James, but I had to mention that big hit. Wow, that was a ringer. A chance for the win! Oh, what a save to keep it tied! They are really pussing here on the offensive end. Game on a stick! For the win! Oh, what a save of the play on here in OT! Oh, you don't get many opportunities to be the overtime hero, James. He cannot believe that he missed this one. Feeds it to Goudreau. Now he takes it over the line. Quick pass to Johansson. The Blues grab possession to the puck. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. Middleton's got the puck in his own zone. Here's a short pass to Johansson. Quick shot, and that caroms off a body in the lane. Denies it in front. And the puck.
Rock Stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. And they win the face-off and set up to go on the attack. Steps in all of that. The Blues move to the offensive zone. Takes that one right in the logo. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. St. Louis takes possession after that offensive zone face-off. Moves it quickly over to Thomas. Off a stick and they can't connect. St. Louis looks to get things... Oh my goodness, it's Stina! What a save! It was all but in, James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in, so focused, when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. St. Louis takes possession off the faceoff. Minnesota's got the puck in the defensive end. Sends it in deep. The Blues gain possession. Good fight for the puck along the boards. With the steal. Puck scooped up by Buchnevich. Shot! Oh, nice stop with the glove by Gustafson. A critical draw here. Minnesota's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Ahead of steam now towards the front. And a stick in the lane to flex that one away. Easily turned aside by Bennington. Let's it go. Oh, turns it aside once again. Lee's out battling his opponent right now. He is so dialed in. He's trapping the puck, making save after save. It's about time his team starts working in front of him. Shot. Steps it through the one-timer and makes the save. Offensive zone face-off. They win the draw and go on the attack. Big play inside the defensive zone. Pushes it across to Spurgeon. Puck grab by Brodeen. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. Moves it to Erickson. Looking to end it. And he denies it with a monstrous here in overtime! We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Blues start with the puck in their own end. Sends a pass over. Odd man rush. Puts it on the end. the win! And he comes up with a huge save! Thanks for joining us.